Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to this new video. This is Mr. Cluster 87. Today it's Saturday the 6th of August 2016. In this video guys, I would like to show you up some news that happened during the summer, basically. So, the first one, of course, it's a huge jump in of uh, the NXT price compared to Bitcoin, as you can see from Poloniex. We reached the 5,000 Satoshi, uh, 5, Satoshi's uh, threshold. UPA, really happy on that. Then, let's see, uh, there was a presentation in Tel Aviv made by Ricker, our core developer. You will find the link of this presentation down below this video guys basically it's called advanced concepts in blockchain design um, made on july 27th then there was a beta release experimental for the next version of the nrs client uh, released by our core developer jean-luc on july the 31st uh, you can see that the version it's 1.10 experimental uh, you can download the version of your operating system so sh for linux exe for exe for windows and dmg for um, the macintosh software ios uh, you can look at the change log so Basically, there will be um, a light wallet while you are keep downloading the blockchain. And once you have finished to download the whole blockchain, you will uh, use the, the normal uh, wallet. Then, what happened over um, exchanges? So basically, we had two major hacks. The one over Kraken, uh, because accounts didn't enable the two-factor authorization authentication, which, guys, it's the ABC for you know security. If you use uh, exchanges, the first thing that you should enable it's of course the two-factor uh, authentication, and secondly, you shouldn't hand your uh, your coin for a long period of time over a third party exchange because you will never know and that's what's happened with Bitcoin so Bitfinex was hacked as we can see you will find all this posts in the link of this video downstairs and basically uh, the um, the Bitfinex user basically will see a generalized loss of generalized loss of 37% of their deposits. So, um, what can I suggest right now? The only project that I see that it's working, it's based on the Bitcoin uh, blockchain, and it's called bit square so if you don't know this decentralized exchange project over the Bitcoin protocol I just really invite you to have a look download the software it will be available for the major operating system Linux as well and uh, the cool thing is that it's really really simple both to download and second to run let's say I will show you a few things for the um, the user interface over bit square here we go so the thing the first thing that you will notice is that it will be connecting to the tool network 
of course you have to uh, enter your passphrase in order to protect the account as well Okay, some hiccups, maybe. Okay. So basically, you in order to trade over VidSquare, you have to leave your uh, computer on because it will connect to peers. Okay, here we are. This is the main, let's say, market user interface. I already, I already set some currency of my interest. One of which is, of course, NXT. But there are many, many other coins added. Um, not the last Ethereum Classic, Ether Classic. So in order to use this uh, decentralized exchange, of course, you have to uh, send some Bitcoin over here. And basically, that's it. So I hope you find this information useful, guys. Uh, see you over the next video. Peace.